Drug Enforcement Administration found record-breaking fentanyl seizures in Minnesota for 2023. And the Minnesota River Valley Drug Task Force releases its own local numbers on drug seizures. Maddie Paul breaks down the findings. We've seen fentanyl powder and pills increase. I think it's just because of the targeted enforcement on it. The Minnesota River Valley Drug Task Force says 5,945 dosage units of fentanyl pills were seized in 2023, compared to over 3,800 units in 2022. No, I think most of it for our area is the agents are so passionate because this stuff has a big effect on our community, and that's what they're going after, too try and stop, slow down, or, you know, get people the help that they need to stop these overdoses or this addiction to the fentanyl. Cocaine and crack have also increased over the years. Agents seized 1,570 grams of cocaine in 2023. That's over 1,200 more grams from the year before. But officials credit law enforcement's willingness to target these substances, especially fentanyl. People are addicted to it and starting to see more of a, a push for it in the areas as it's you know coming more and more readily available. One positive trend, the Minnesota Department of Health says there's a 19% drop in overdose deaths. The Minnesota River Valley Drug Task Force says they've assisted in at least 15 overdose death investigations. We're always here, we're here for the people and that's you know what our mission is is to help everybody. Maddie Paul, KEYC News Now.